The name Primrose, intriguingly, traces its roots to the lands of Primrose in the parish of Dunfermline. While its exact etymology is debated, some suggest that it originated from the old British term Pren Rose, which translates to Tree of the Moor. This poetic interpretation hints at the clan's deep connection to the Scottish countryside. The Primrose family's roots in Scotland run deep, with early records indicating their presence in Fife, particularly around the Abbey of Cooras, as early as the 15th century. This period in history was marked by significant social and political changes in Scotland, setting the stage for the clan's rise to prominence. Throughout their history, Clan Primrose produced a lineage of distinguished individuals who left an indelible mark on Scottish society. Among these notable figures were Gilbert Primrose, a grandson of Henry Primrose, Gilbert served as a minister of the Reformed Church in London, and his appointment as chaplain to James VI and Charles I marked his significant role in the royal court. In 1628, he achieved the prestigious position of Dean of Windsor. Archibald Primrose, a staunch royalist, Archibald Primrose's loyalty to the monarchy led him to rally to the banner of the Marquis of Montrose during the tumultuous years of the Civil War. Despite being captured, tried for treason, and imprisoned, Archibald Primrose ultimately received a knighthood from Charles I. Lord Carrington, Archibald Primrose later adopted the title Lord Carrington and held several high-ranking offices, including Judge of the Supreme Court and Lord Clerk Register of Scotland. His legacy also includes acquiring the Barony of Barnboogle and Dalmeny, a place that remains significant in the clan's history to this day. The Primrose clan experienced the highs and lows of political fortune. The second Viscount Primrose died without an heir in 1706, leading to a lapse in the clan's titles. However, Archibald Primrose, born in 1664, played a pivotal role in revitalizing the family's fortunes. He served in the Imperial Army in Hungary, opposed James VII's policies, and was appointed a gentleman of the bedchamber during the reign of William and Mary. Archibald's contributions were rewarded with the creation of the title Viscount of Rosebery, Lord Primrose and Dalmeny in 1700. Subsequently, in 1707, he played a key role as a commissioner for the Treaty of Union, a significant event in Scotland's history. The Primrose clan's legacy endures through the centuries. Their family seat at Dalmeny, a place of architectural and historical significance, is now open to the public, allowing visitors to step back in time and explore the clan's heritage.